How's it going guys? Welcome to Nautilus. Today we're going to be talking about the Hammerhead E2 Hybrid. Uh, I literally just got this gun in about a week ago, so I'm going to give you guys a quick little uh, review on it. And for the most part, it looks like Hammer did, uh, Hammerhead did a pretty good job. Uh, if you want, come on in, show you some of the, uh, some of the features on this thing. Uh, we'll start over here at the tip of, tip of the gun. Standard Hawaiian flopper, heavy duty uh, flopper which is a nice upgrade compared to the old flopper they used to use, spring steel shaft same as before. Uh, you got the, uh, the pin over here for the uh, line wrap to keep the shaft in place. The uh, band slots are, uh, are separated so you actually would have to either tie the bands or if you got the loop system which is what they come with you can pass the band through then do the, uh, do the self constricting knot. Uh, you got the line anchor down here which is really nice. Uh, gives it a little bit of ballasting and also uh, Nice and secure for the uh, shooting line bungee, or if you have a reel, uh, can help guide the uh, guide the uh, reel line. As you work your way down the uh, down the stock, you'll notice it has some pretty cool shape to it. Uh, the track is actually eh, somewhat recessed, which is pretty nice. A little bit more recessed than it would be on a rail gun. Um, and then the uh, on the bottom here, you'll see it has the uh, the uh, reel mounting uh, piece here on the back so you can uh, you know you can just slide your reel on there you don't have to drill or do anything like that um, as you work your way back it see it kinda tapers off a little bit and then uh, you got the E2 uh, handle which is the same handle you'll see on the pipe guns um, same safety system same uh, uh, trigger sensitivity where you can adjust the trigger pull to a light or heavy pull side line release which is always nice stainless steel mechanism housing and then you'll notice it has the, uh, the mono, you can actually run it underneath uh, these slots here. So when you pull the bands back, it doesn't get in the way. What's kind of cool, I mean, it's kind of a cool little custom feature. Hammerhead did uh, actually print on their, uh, uh, their logo up here on the bottom of the stock, which is pretty cool little uh, extra feature that they did. So for the most part, I think it's a pretty sweet gun. Um, we just put them up on the site, so if you guys want to check them out a little bit more, just click on the uh, link below on the video. And I uh, hope you guys liked it. Check you guys out on the next one.